but the most insidious aphid killer is the parasitic wasp. This is a female trying to lay its eggs on the body of the aphids. They sense danger and try to kick the wasp. This wasp has found a dead aphid, but even so, it oviposits inside the body. The parasitized insects become spheroid in shape, and the skin is transformed from a soft tissue into a hard shell that will protect the wasp larva as it develops. This is the wasp larva once it has eaten the aphid. If we extract one of these larvae from a dead aphid, it will try to find a protective place or it will die by desiccation. But normally they remain inside the host and in a protective cover of silk. The hardened skin cannot be broken easily. But if the lady beetle is persistent, it will finally do it, and feed on the wasp larva. After a few days, the metamorphosis is complete, and the new wasp emerges. These wasps diminished their size as they evolved from bigger wasps in order to be able to exploit other organisms. And now there are about 2,000 species of these minute parasitic creatures.